everything else is the kitchen. Um, when doing this, it's quite a small room, so I was thinking about fitting everything in. And when I met with our uh, company that have fitted a few of our kitchens, he actually came up with the idea of taking out some of the chimney breast and putting the cooker inside, um, which I really like. There were, however, things about the house not to like, and that came in the form of damp and rot. Um, we actually had the house damp injected and lowered the course of the bricks outside on the pavement to help prevent it. And then also, as we took up carpets and stuff like that, we found some woodworm. So we got it treated at the same time by the same company with the damp. Vicky works for the family construction business and property developing is a bit of a sideline. She's been helped along the way by her father, Peter. You are not alone. He oversees everything, <laughs> um, who I report back to and everything. He's also very supportive and allows me to have my ideas and work and let me make my own mistakes as well as things go on. Yes, it's always good to have someone to turn to in the inevitable stressful moments that crop up when refurbishing a property. But property development isn't just about making the right changes and upgrades, it's also about doing it at the right price. My original budget was 40,000 and I was just over 40,000 when finished. <laughs> £40,000 on top of the £225,000 purchase price means Vicky has brought this project in at £265,000. 